Hey, uh, I'll start another video, but I'm gonna shoot. So this is the same pipe, same outfit, or not? That's my last video. But um, I'll space them out a couple of days, so it's like you have a couple of episodes. Because the cold front's coming back through, and uh, which means weather, storms, rain, and crap. So it's I try to think it's going to be pretty great for the next few days, though. So. I don't know. Anyway, but like I said in my last video, it doesn't stay cold, but it's the transitions are terrible. I get real nervous when it gets real warm. You know, like two weeks ago, it was like 75 or something. You know, in early January. And all that means is when the cold comes, the storms come, and then if you you know if you're sitting in 75 degree weather, when a cold storm's coming through, that's why there's so many tornadoes you know in April and so is because those mixtures of hot and cold air and I get so worried about tornadoes, especially now you know and I'm spooked. Um, but. Uh, in case you forgot, this is Boswell's, no, this is a Boswell pipe, but this is uh, Peaches and Cream from Uptown's Cigar Shop. It's okay. It's not great. Anyway, um, what I wanted to tell you was, it's that time of year again, man, for uh, the Briary annual event with the Slow Smoking Contest and the special guests. This year, uh, there's going to be sales representatives from Drew Estate Cigars and uh, Eric Nording, the Danish pipe maker, is going to be there. This is a pretty big deal, man. Eric Nording is a pretty big name. So, I wouldn't miss out on that, dude. I'll be there. That's probably the biggest thing is I'll be there. And if enough of you guys show up, I'll wear this hat. Yeah. So if you're in the southeast, near Birmingham, you know, even within three hours' drive of Birmingham, it's definitely worth it, man. I mean, last year, they had... <laughs> okay, who's the comedian? I hope that wind's not jacking with the microphone. Who, who's the comedian who made the joke about the guitar guy? Was it Adam Sandler who talked about the guitar guy? Or somebody... You know, the guitar guy in college is the guy who... Anytime you're in an apartment, somebody's apartment or something, you see a guitar, he's the guy who picks it up and starts singing Dave Matthews songs or something. Well, that guy was at the Briary last year. Can I not talk to myself and make videos? You had a bacon bit? They have a Tinkerbell tea set with tea poured in the pot and in a cup and bowls full of this. So now we have no bacon bit for the salad. I'll go get some. You want me to go get some now? All right. Nice having tea party, eating bacon bits. That's how we roll around here. Anyway, there was a guitar guy at the Briary. It was awesome, dude. It was just some some dude. Man, I hope he's not a YouTuber and sees this. I don't like to talk bad about people, but that guy, that was funny. I was thinking that the whole time. It's hard for me not to laugh. There's a lot of cool dudes there, man. Uh... But anyway, it's uh it's a really great time, man. It's a fantastic establishment, an old farmhouse that they stuff full of pipes and tobacco, and they do have a amazing selection of pipes and tobacco. Of course, they're gonna be showcasing Eric Nording stuff. So and Drew Estate stuff, of course. Because I think in their newsletter they said that uh, uh, Drew Estates makes a cigar for Eric Norton. So I'm sure that collaborative effort will be at the forefront of their propaganda and samples. Hey, last year when, when Eric Sokoby was there, uh, who's the president of Peter Sokoby, or, or Villager Sokoby, or whatever it is. Uh, he um, 
they were giving away cigars. It was kind of a, you know, like six or seven dollars a stick or something. So what they did was, they didn't just kind of throw it in the front for everybody. So they just, you know, Birmingham is kind of a college town. They have UAB there. I think they have a couple other four-year colleges there. And um, so they got a lot of students. And these dudes just come in and, you know, wreak havoc on free stuff. So they would just kind of pull people aside and that were serious cigar smokers and offer them cigars. And I turned Eric down because I really wasn't interested in their cigars. But um, come on down, man, if you guys can. I mean, who am I to invite you? But I'm just, I, I would suggest that you try to make it if you can. February the 4th at the Briary. Thebriary.com. Check it out, man. It's going to be a fun time. I'll be there. I didn't know last year they had chicken wings until they told me about it in the newsletter this year. Which is kind of lame because I went to the kitchen and all I saw was like hosted cupcakes and a bunch of lame stuff. I didn't see any chicken wings. I will not make the same mistake twice, friend. Anyway, hope to see you there. God bless you and I hope you have a wonderful day.